Well, we're a quarter of the way through the season, and we're starting to get a clear picture on where teams are right now. Hey guys, Dick's Report here, back to you with another Weekly Picks. Let's jump right into Week 5. Okay, our Thursday night game is going to be Tampa Bay traveling to Chicago. Going to go Tampa on this one. Tom Brady and that offense is on fire right now, and that defense is a lot better than I expected it to be. The Rams are traveling to Washington. I'm going to go with the Rams on this one. They are 3-1 right now. Looks like they're back after a disappointing season last year. Buffalo's traveling Tennessee. We got a match of undefeated teams for Tennessee. They weren't able to do a whole lot last week because of multiple positive COVID tests. And Buffalo, Josh Allen is just on a roll right now. He is having a breakout season. I'm going to do it with him and the Bills on this one. Philadelphia is traveling to Pittsburgh. Philadelphia, even though they're 1-2-1, one, one, they lead the NFC East. That's how bad that division is. And Pittsburgh... Their game was postponed last week because of Tennessee's multiple COVID positive tests. I'm going to go with Pittsburgh on this one. Arizona's challenging to the Jets. For the Jets, they are the worst team in football right now. Adam Gase is fighting for his job. And for the Cardinals, they had a disappointing showing against the Panthers. But I am picking them to rebound against the Jets. Raiders are traveling to KC. For KC, they had back-to-back -back Monday night games after their game for the Patriots got moved. And for the Raiders, they had a tough loss against the Bills. I'm going with the Chiefs to stay undefeated. Jacksonville's traveling to Houston. For Houston, they finally... Jacksonville's traveling to Houston. For Houston, they fired Bill O'Brien. If you ask me, they should have fired him after that playoff game against KC last year. And Jacksonville, they are 1-3 right now, but they have been fighting in every single game they have played. I'm going with them over their division rival. Cincinnati's traveling to Baltimore. I'm going to go with Baltimore on this one, but don't be surprised if Cincinnati pulls out a victory. It's because they are Baltimore's kryptonite right now. Cincinnati always seems to find a way to win over Baltimore. I'm going with Baltimore, but don't be surprised if Cincinnati pulls out the victory. Carolina's traveling to Atlanta. For Atlanta, they are 0-4 right now. Dan Quinn is another head coach that is fighting for his job. And for Carolina, after an 0-2 start, they are 2-2 right now. And Teddy Bridgewater is looking really good right now. I'm going with Carolina over Atlanta. Miami's traveling to San Francisco. San Francisco has been battling so many injuries. They're coming off a Monday. Miami's traveling to San Francisco. For San Francisco, they've been battling so many injuries. They're coming off a Sunday night loss to Philadelphia. And I'm still going to go with them over Miami. Giants traveling to Dallas. For Dallas, they're off to a 1-3 start. But Dak Prescott is doing everything that he can to get the Cowboys a victory. But the defense is just not helping him out. And for the Giants, they have not gotten a win yet. Daniel Jones is just not looking good right now in his second season. Going to go with Dallas over New York. Indianapolis is traveling to Cleveland. Both of these teams, they're off to pretty good starts right now. Phillip Rivers is showing that he's not done yet. And for Cleveland, their offense has been red hot the last three weeks. I'm actually going to go with Cleveland over Indianapolis. Yeah, that's a shocker. Denver is traveling to New England. For New England, Cam Newton tested positive for COVID last week. Missed the game against the Chiefs. I have no idea when he's going to be back. And for Denver, they've gone through three quarterbacks already this season. I'm going to go with New England over Denver. Minnesota is traveling to Seattle. Seattle, Russell Wilson is playing like an MVP right now. And for Minnesota, able to get their first one of the season against the Texans last week. I'm going to go with Seattle over Minnesota. And our Monday night game is the Chargers traveling to New Orleans. For the Chargers, Justin Herbert looks like the real deal. He is playing really good football right now. And New Orleans got back on the winning track last week, able to come back from behind early in the game against the Lions, pull out a victory. I'm going to go with New Orleans over the Chargers. All right, guys, those were my picks for Week 5, and I'll see you next time.